The irresistible force. One of the most dominant women in WWE history. Physically unparalleled in the women's division, Nia Jax has imposed her will on everyone that stepped in the ring as opposition. An incredible pedigree for success for Nia Jax. It's the Queen of Spades! Just to give you some insight into how Shayna Baszler thinks, she says... This ought to be good. She prefers to break someone's mind before she breaks their body. She's the submission magician. Protégé of Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Shayna Baszler, so impressive, so dangerous. One of the most physical women in all of sports entertainment. Yeah, and she knows it, too. Pretty amazing, Shayna Baszler, the first of the MMA Four Horsewomen to win a title in WWE. Quite the accomplishment for Shayna Baszler. Welcome! the Empress of Tomorrow! Her dominance, her unique appearance, and her unmistakable aura have all made Asuka one of the top competitors in the entire women's division. An undefeated run in NXT, NXT Women's Champion, a title she relinquished willingly to head to Monday Night Raw. One of the most dominant female superstars ever in WWE. Here comes the Queen! Back at NXT, Charlotte was part of a group called the Four Horsewomen with Sasha Banks, Bailey, and Becky Lynch. Wow, has Charlotte evolved from those times? Many believe Corey Charlotte is the greatest of all time. When it comes to history, making moments, capturing championships, and excelling inside the squared circle, nobody does it quite like Charlotte Flair. One day, she'll be joining her father in the Hall of Fame.
Hope you're ready. Well, anytime Nia Jax and Asuka face off, it's the old... And it's Asuka making a move. She better do something fat. Whoa, impressive. You could say that again. I never thought she'd break free from that one. Superstars in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment. They must find a way back to their corner to tag their partner. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar the ability to move and catch their breath. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful is their ability to endure punishment and make their way to their partner when they need to tag out. One way to do that is to create that separation you spoke of so they have some space to gather themselves and time to make their way back to the corner. You're absolutely right, Michael. What's the use of having a tag team partner if you're not able to get to them when you got to tag out of the match? Getting that separation is key in breaking any momentum your opponents could have may be the difference between a win and a loss, maybe even more. Oh. The smartest thing a young star can do is learn from a veteran. And Charlotte has the best in the wrestling business. The nature boy, Ric Flair. If you're lucky as a rookie, you can bend the ear of a trainer or a visiting legend for a few minutes. But Charlotte has had 30 years to learn from her father. What grace! Float over into the... Oh, nasty impact. Corey Charlotte's knowledge of the game is limitless thanks to Rick. When you're learning from the Nature Boy, it's like an advanced class every day. Imagine having Flip. Uh-oh. She better do something fast. Ah, oh, she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Charlotte is in a bad way here. I'm not sure if the Queen can rebound. Oof. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. She's putting up quite a fight here, Cole, but despite that, now is probably a good time to look for the tag. If you ask a member of the WWE Universe about the four horsewomen, they'll likely refer to the quartet of Charlotte, Bailey, Sasha Banks, and Becky Lynch. However, there's another group that lays claim to that moniker, and it includes Ronda Rousey and Shayna Baszler. Yeah, both groups actually met face-to-face -face at the Mae Young Classic. Ronda Rousey, Jessamyn Duke, and Marina Shafir were there to root on Shayna. Submission time! The two of you brought up the collision between WWE's and MMA's four horsewomen. She works her way out of the hold. And I don't know how. That was locked in pretty good. Nia Jackson off the tag. Nasty drop. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. What a stomp! Good grief! Tag team competition dates back all the way to the Early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit.
I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, the New Day, the Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus. I could be here all day naming championship caliber teams. And when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team will be wearing the gold. The first ever women's Royal Rumble match was full of amazing moments. But here comes Asuka. She got her episode. Oh, sliding hip attack. She can hit. She goes for the cover. A kick out. This one's not over yet. She's still in this one. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. Oh, this one's all but over. It's locked in. Fellas, let's go. The Oscar lock. Uh oh. Oh, it's over. I wouldn't be surprised if that caused some serious internal injuries. There's the switch. Charlotte is in. An early pin by Charlotte here. I like the Queen's thought process. Digging deep for a kick out. She's still in this one. Escapes trouble there. Dominating shoulder tackle. You gotta believe this one's over. This is it. The leg drop across the throat. She has got to take it. And a pin attempt. And the kick out. She's still in this one. Boom! <laughs> Great power. Oh, my Lord. It, is that it? Is it over? Penny predicament. This might be it. Oh, my. And the ref goes down. We need a new ref out here fast. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match, and your opponents are playing catch-up. Got the leg. Oh! Dragon Whip connects. The two out of three falls match that saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a broad kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss cyborg. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down and the third fall was ruled a double countout. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage and that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots, but I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. And what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record-setting 483 days. Three. And Shayna Baszler evades that one. She goes down hard. She's going to be feeling that one for a while. Four. The challenger not looking good right now. The challenger's championship aspirations are beginning to fade. She's taking on quite a bit of damage here, guys. And if she doesn't find a way to make the tag soon, this one might be over. So she's taking a little punishment here. No big deal. She's still in better shape than her opponent, I'd say. The queen stepping through. Here's the figure four. Yeah, now she's got a bridge into the figure eight. If she can do it, she's going to put this one away. And there it is. To the 
figure eight. That's just Charlotte proving her dominance once again. Amazingly, she works her way free. Cole, there may be no beating her here tonight. Charlotte sure dodged that one. She did indeed. Harsh impact. Getting closer now. You know, there it is. She's made the tag. And her partner is on absolute fire right now. Oh, man, she's rolling now. Eludes that one. She is on fire. And no luck against Nia Jax there. Quick thinking by Nia Jax. And Asuka was able to get out of the way there. Six. Tough spot here for the champ. She might just have nothing left to give at this point. Yeah, she's in a very bad spot here. I don't know how much more of this she can take. The ring just shifted. Nailed it. Ooh, what impact. Comes in off the tag. Oh, and she makes the tag. And not a moment too soon, Michael. She counters before it's too late. The Queen gaining momentum. She's calling for it. Kick right to the midsection. And I think we know what's coming up next, Michael. Indeed we do. Natural selection. I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. And executed with such quickly into the cover. With the title on the line. The champion. Oh, how resilient was that? Wow. Charlotte is getting ready here. She's not done. Beautiful technique. That's just Charlotte proving her dominance. The momentum shifts to Charlotte now. We'll see how long she can keep it up. You've got to believe this one's over. She might have it. Oh, continuing to punish them. Warm up the bus. This one is over. That's it. This one is over. Let's take another look at these women in action. That's a woman on a mission. Look at her go. Almost forgot about this one. She proves she has what it takes to be one of the best in the business. Dominating tap out victory here. There's few things more humiliating than tapping out to your opponent. I couldn't agree more. What an amazing contest that was.